The helicopter video Ted retweeted was fake. <laughs> a viral video claiming to show a man being brutally hanged from a helicopter in Kandahar was likely an attempt to fix a flag over a public building, not a hanging. Wait, why did they think this was a hanging? Ted Cruz retweeted it. Bro, his hands are moving. Like, you can literally see that, like, who the fuck gets hanged like that? Why wouldn't they just hang him? Why would they hang him using a helicopter? At this point, said retweeted tweet from Ted. This horrifying image encapsulates Joe Biden's Afghanistan catastrophe. The Taliban hanging a man from an American Black Hawk helicopter. Tragic, unimaginable. Ted Cruz be like, it's only appropriate if American JSOC operatives are hanging people from a helicopter. Like, even if it's, even if it's real, it's like, like, how does this justify our, our ongoing efforts in Afghanistan? You know what I mean? Anyway, he's not actually on a fucking, he's not being hanged. He's on a harness. Inshallah, we'll make this hanging the most difficult one yet. It will be sick, bro. What I find to be remarkable is the fact that they were able to fly the fucking helicopters. Like, they picked that shit up so quick. Motherfuckers were like, oh, dude, yeah, they'll never learn. Afghan pilots flying. This is someone I have known for years. He was trained in the U.S. and UAE. He confirmed to me that he flew the Black Hawk helicopter. The Taliban fighter seen here is trying to install a Taliban flag from the air, but it didn't work in the end. You know, overall, overall remarkable that they just like, they just, they, they just immediately picked that shit up, dude. Wallahi, bro, if you drop me, inshallah, I will, I will, <laughs> I will come back to haunt you, bro. Wallahi, bro, if you fucking drop me, I will come back to haunt you and your family, you motherfucker. They're playing GTA, no cop cheat mode on. Look at him. I think he's, wait, is he fucking, what is he doing with his hand? Is he filming himself? He's like, Astaghfirullah. I am being hanged, bro. Do you see that? My man's taking, my man's taking selfies, dude. I am being brutally hanged right now. <laughs> this one's for the gram, bro. Inshallah. I will get many babes. I will get many babes. They will all say, Fatima will say, oh my God, Ahmed, you look so good. You looked so sexy in the fucking photo. Amrant, my queen. <laughs> I'm going to put this on TikTok and Amrant will notice. Finally. <laughs> Bros, thanks for clicking on to my IG live. Inshallah, ladies, you can hang up here with me if you're lucky. Ladies, come to Afghanistan. Yeah, he's like, you know, this one I learned from uh, David Dobrik. You know, like uh, when uh, he swung Jeff Witek. Just like that, you know, bro, I am doing the same. <laughs> David Dobrik. Fuck you. The Taliban will do this, but they won't do the fucking crate challenge, dude. Okay? Cowards. They're like, no, no way, bro. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> no. Sorry. Astaghfirullah. We don't do the crate challenge, bro. What, are you, what do you think? We're stupid. You think we're going to do the crate challenge? Are you crazy? I will fall. <laughs> the dude is just chilling. Yeah, I mean, he's like giving a thumbs up and shit. Yeah. Inshallah, you can't. <laughs> Allah protection. <laughs> the CIA already got us once. The great challenge won't fool us again.
How is this the easiest way to hang up a flag? Wait, Donald Trump Jr.'s profile photo? But he knew what he signed up for, believe me. Hanging U.S. infidels from helicopter? <laughs> Oh, uh, David Dobrik. This man. This man. We are doing what this man showed us. Okay, we learned from you, David Dobrik. We learned from you. <coughs> David Dostum. <laughs> David Dostum. Oh, no. Yes, Dawood. Dawood Dostum. Yes, did you not know? David, Do David Dostum, he's, uh, he's uh, living in Turkey. He was living in Turkey. Now he's in uh, Tajikistan. Wallahi, bro, if you drop me, inshallah, I will, I will, <laughs> I will come back to haunt you, bro. Yeah. Allahi bro, if you fucking drop me, I will come back to haunt you and your family, you motherfucker.